for my knees, they yo. Want these in a hard way? Trying to see you all out of there. Chop the disc to catch your face. That was the disc song coming by way of when Feezy. And now we got that man Cutter E and T. One Feezy, man, my guy on the coat. But before we get started, what's going on today, La Familia? Y'all know I had to ask y'all how y'all doing, family. Man, I can't just hop in this thing without checking on my peoples, man. Make sure you wipe your feet as you come in the door by hitting that like button, subscribe, ring the bell icon, turn post notifications on all, drop a comment, let me know how I did. And if you're really rocking with the gang, go ahead and drop a share. And if you want to hate, go ahead and hate. But make sure you tap in. Just give some feedback. You know we need that. Believe it. But nah, for real though, man. We got the response from that man, one Theezy. And the initial response came from a post that his partner, man. You know the driller, man. We just talked about him. Go check out that video as well. It's the last upload. in that man, TBG Osama. Now, TBG Osama was asked a question on the anonymous question you know the game that they got where people can ask you anonymous questions and you'll never know who it is well they asked him this question right here and man they got very disrespectful with when feezy as they said you seen that dumb a song crack feezy made with the laughing emoji to which that man tbg osama responded and said he trying to steal my dog swag and added one feezy with the laughing emoji to which one Theezy went ahead and shared the post and said swagger jacker with the laughing emojis and whatnot. Now that was the first time that he responded to the situation. Side note, as of about five minutes ago, he had just responded again and he says, I might act dumb and blind, but I ain't stupid. I pay attention to every and everybody. I think he meant everything and everybody. But check it, I'ma say this. Observing one Theezy for as long as I have, you know, for a few years now, I noticed a few things, man. When it comes to the case of One Theezy, One Theezy utilizes a lot of prison tactics. You know what I'm saying? Like his mentality is like a person that is going to give you, you I believe him when he say this because Theezy that type of person that's gonna allow you to play him stupid. He's gonna play that stupid role, but the whole time you playing yourself. He gonna give you the rope to hang yourself. You know what I'm saying? And make sure that you hang. Cause whatever your underlying intentions was, they gonna come out by the time he shows you what's really what he really been having going on in his head the whole time you've been thinking you was playing him stupid he been watching and tallying you know what i'm saying that that's a prison tactic a prison mentality you know what i'm saying that's a mentality of you know i'm always two steps ahead of you even though you think you ahead of me you know what i'm saying so i believe him when he say that on the cool and he just letting it be known like hey look i don't care about nothing that's going on Keep me away from all that. Yeah, I see everything that's going on, but I don't care. It don't matter to me. Ain't got nothing to do with me. So stay away from me with all the extras. You feel me? And that's what I take from him saying that. You know what I'm saying? Let that man crash out over there by himself. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But on the cool though, family, we got something else to talk about. As one Theezy's artist, J1, you know, his artist signed a cut of ENT. Man, this dude got them bars, man. Them bar bars. As... He let it be known how he felt about the overall situation, as well as going ahead and allowing us YouTube, so don't be on no BS, to go ahead and show y'all the snippet of the music. And he sent some shiggities, man, at Smooth RB, you know, and uh, also Michi, and spoke about the one Feezy situation and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? And uh, the man, hey, the man, you know what we say? When we say, if it ain't directed, it ain't respected, well, that man went straight direct with it but first he commented under the video that we posted about one feezy on ig and if you ain't tapped into the ig go tap in man at all facts king ko all lowercase and show your boy some love man because we do our thing on there too but he said stuff trash all them dudes gonna pass you know what i'm saying and let me clear it up because he not saying he gonna do anything to anybody you know what i'm saying he just saying you know that uh, life is gonna get to them eventually and that music is garbage, you know what I'm saying? Basically, he's saying, y'all ain't gonna make it out the hood with that music. That's, that's what we gonna say. That's what he's saying right there on the cool. But he also dropped this song, man, and I'm gonna go ahead and play it for y'all, man, and I'm telling y'all, man, dude got bars. Man is a monster, I'm telling y'all, man. 
Man is a monster. Draco quit when hunting around. She got shot in the shit. Now he look funny now. These niggas, they be safe all on the grandma. Oh, yeah, it's funny now. Till one of them bitches laying on the ground with their stomach out. Hey, I'm telling you, man, got boards, man. He got boards. Got top play. He won't smoke, dog. I can't wait until I catch that bitch. Trust that bitch and man, them fuck niggas that he be stepping. He got on Tyler head right quick, didn't he? Yeah, miss it, don't go to court on the yo-yo with that telling shit And smooth the RB, that nigga been a bitch Don't rap niggas with benefits Catch a body with you, then they tell a shit That man calling man's out, ain't he? He on the gas, gas, boy He kill all on ground, like step on shit Oh, yeah. oh you say you yeah? yeah. Hop out and bust your fucking head Oh, you on niggas dead yeah. Look, J1, I'm telling you When I'm saying I'm telling you Man, dude, nice I told y'all, I told y'all my boy nice I told y'all, go tap in. Flow is crazy. Bars, man, hey, dude is nice, man. Dude is dude is definitely nice, man. Y'all better get on board right now, man. Hey, I'm telling you, crazy. I, I can say this, man. TBG, man, all these people that they signing, man, dope artists, man. They finding some truly dope artists, man. Like, hey, man, they finding some truly dope. Trap Land, Pat, uh, uh, who else? Hot Boy Dude. This man, J1, man, they, they finding some dope artists. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Cannot forget about low-key Jace, man. He been he been doing his thing, too, man. Hey, they been finding some jewels, bro. Y'all see the caption right there, though? He said, F the other side. KLE stuff with the gorilla emoji, man. That's right, that's right, man. Cut a living entertainment, man. Yeah, hey, I'm telling y'all, man. This, this dude, he gonna be the next one to blow, man. So y'all go... Y'all take down all this man's ads right here, man. Go ahead and check this out, man. Go to his Instagram. Show him some love, man. And figure out what you need to do to get a feature or anything, man. Or just support Ratchet AJ. Y'all see him. Hey, right, go tap in, bro. That's his Instagram right there. But on the cool, man, we also got a response from that man, Seven Hardaway. And it was like a little subtle one, man. And this is how it went right here. This one was one that definitely went over a lot of heads because he shared... Rod Wave song with lyrics, the one that says, say what you say about me, but them young dudes don't play about me. You know what I'm saying? Basically letting it be known like, hey, look, bro. Hey, say what you want to in them songs, but on the cool, you know, leave me out of it. That ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Hey, and, that, and that, that's the message that he trying to send. Like, rightfully so, though, man. Don't put me in your songs or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But on the cool, man, it's just a little subtle shiggity. Coming by way of that man, Seven Hardaway, man. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about that. Now, before we get up out of here, I do want to close everything out by saying this because I feel as though everything was not covered. There was one thing that a queen said on Instagram that really sparked my interest. And it, it really caught my attention because she said, and it's facts, it's facts too. She said, it's been over a year since the situation happened with BBGD. Why is one Feezy coming out now in 2022 speaking on a situation as well as speaking on BBG uh, Baby Joe in that video he did or whatever. Y'all go check out that video if y'all want to see my comments on that. But it's been over a year, man. And you, you want to come out with this response. You know what I'm saying? For what? For some stuff that already hit everybody's attention and then went away. You know what I'm saying? I, I just don't understand it, man. And in my opinion, that's why I gave y'all that opinion, opinion and said, I feel as though BBGD allegedly, let me say that for all the extra people, kind of made him feel like he had to do something, say something, or seem as though, you know, I'm riding right now by putting that on wax, you know, allegedly. Once again, I'm not saying that he riding or doing any criminal activity. What I'm saying is it seems as though he feels like he had to do something right now, you know, because BBG D, man, he felt like nobody riding for him, you know. Pops ain't riding for me. Nobody got my back. But one thing that one Feezy, I don't feel like took into accountability is the things that he was saying and, and what he was putting out there into the world, man, because that song could get a lot of people locked up like no cap, man. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about this situation. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell icon, and turn post notifications on to all. That way you will be notified every time we drop a video, as well as dropping a comment and share. That way this video will be recommended to a lot more people. And y'all already know, all praise be to the most high. 
peace and blessings, kings and queens. With that being said, I'm out. Believe it.